Prepare these macaroni with meat and cheese, I am very sure that your family will love them. I will start by first cutting the top off three ripe tomatoes, then cutting the tomatoes in half, and finally into chunks. I'll quickly take the cut tomatoes to the blender. Guys, the macaroni and meat and cheese that we are making are very easy to make and it is very delicious, I am sure that everyone in your family will like the result. I'm also going to add in the blender two large onion slices together with the tomatoes. Then add to it a tablespoon of sugar, half a teaspoon of salt. I will cover and blend these ingredients very well for two minutes. And so this way we should stay. In a pan add a little olive oil. Then add is all the mixture of the blender. And I will move a little to incorporate the tomato mixture with the olive oil. Then seasoning and adding a teaspoon of salt. And I will constantly move for 5 minutes until it becomes a slightly thick sauce. This is how it should stay. In a pot with boiling water, add a teaspoon of salt. I will also add 250 grams of pasta and let it cook over high heat for 7 minutes or as indicated on the package. After a while and our part is cooked, I'm going to remove it from the hot water. In another skillet add a drizzle of olive oil, one finely chopped onion, two crushed garlic cloves, and fry these ingredients very well. When it has suffered well, I will add 350 grams of ground meat and I will spread it a little with the help of a spatula. Now I am going to season it by adding a teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of oregano, a pinch of black pepper, and I will mix until the meat changes color. Once the meat has changed color, I will add the tomato sauce that I have prepared and I will stir a little to incorporate it with the ground meat. At this point, I'll add all the cooked pasta that I had reserved. At this moment I would like to know from which country or city you are looking at us to send a special greeting in the next recipe. The greeting in today's recipe is for Angela Silva Rodriguez from Peru, also for Marta Pacetti from Argentina, thank you for always watching and enjoying our recipes. And I am going to add 50 grams of grated mozzarella cheese and I will mix to incorporate the pasta with the ground meat. If you've come this far, looking at today's recipe, that means you're liking this recipe, so leave us the following message below, I love macaroni, to send you a very special greeting. Finally, I will add a little more mozzarella cheese, cover and cook over low heat until the cheese melts. And our noodles with meat are ready, look how delicious it was. I'm sure your family will love it. I would like you to rate the recipe from 0 to 10, to know if you like the result. Thank you for watching this recipe until the end, I hope you liked the result. Tell me if it's the first time you see one of my recipes, and if so, don't forget to share this recipe, so you can always receive our recipes. A hug, and see you in the next recipe.